All right, jumping back into Final Fantasy Tactics Advance 2. So we last left off doing even more missions. Um, a, a big part of what we do in this series, of course, is we don't jump straight to the mainline missions. We just do all the side missions. So that's really what we're doing even now. So we've got a few there. What do we already... I should have checked this before. Have we accepted any? I don't recall. It's been about a week since I've played. Quest list is, is empty. And this is what we've done. Cool. Let's jump in. We have so many to do as well. It's kind of crazy. I guess I could have seen that in the upper right hand corner. It literally says quest accepted 0 out of 15. And I just didn't I just didn't look. Uh, <laughs> that's a little bit embarrassing. I'm just like, I wonder how many quests we have. I wonder if 0 means we have none. Alright, the way of the meek. Someone's after me. I'm sure of it. But why? I haven't a clue. I'm so very frightened. Please, someone protect me. If it's Gil you want, I can pay. Davis the Meek. Yeah, sure. A simple question. What are the judges really? My beau. He's in an adjudged clan. Saw the ceremony of the pact when they were in initiating him. They say if you swear, you will never die. But isn't that strange? I mean, it's unnatural, and I don't trust it. Someone please explain to me what this is all about. Milamela, concern for her bow. Sure. That seems good. The way of the meek. Protect the, po the poster from a mysterious assailant. Sure. I'll do it. I'm down. <sighs> Protect Davis and defe defeat all foes. Items are forbidden. I think that's fine. I mean, honestly, traditionally, we don't use items too much. I at least feel we don't. This feels like a very familiar mission. We just did this with like a potion dude, I, I swear. It's like a little bit different, but it's pretty much the same. Like, I don't, I don't know. I don't think it's that different. Let's, uh, oh gosh, I feel stupid. Like, why would we not, why would we not use the warrior? Yeah, let me load this. Let me do this. This makes more sense. Uh, then clan privilege. I mean, we wanna we wanna do the uh, bonus clan points because it just makes you know it's a better for boost and then also territory now apparently can be bidded on. Here they come! It's those bandits! Please stop them! Protect me with all your strength. You there? Let's have what you're carrying. All of it. You're kidding, right? Do we look like the type to take that lane uh, lying down? That's right. You think we just hand it over? Ha! Wrong again. So, so you just back off. You scum aren't even fit to look upon me, much less rob me. Ha! Strong words from one so weak. Listen, thief. I've had it with your babbling. I've a mind to silence you forever. Oh, this dude's... This dude's a problem. Davis, what do they mean, thief? Yeah, we're gonna need. I feel like we're defending a thief here. I don't know how I feel about this. I feel. You know, actually, I know how I feel. I, I don't like this. They're, they're in the right. We shouldn't even hurt them. We should join them. Uh, that doesn't make sense. I don't think our uh, mage can jump a height that tall. Honestly, perfect position for Davis. I would strongly prefer he just stay out of the way. I don't need his help. I don't need anything. I guess I should have known he was a thief. Like, considering how he's dressed. He's like in the thief garb. I didn't really... I didn't really put two and two together. 
You can have Finn here just kind of chilling. You can have Caleb here as well. Perfect. I mean, I know I'm throwing Adele here in, like, a, a rough situation, to say the least. She's going to take a lot of damage. It's going to hurt. But I think the value is there from stealing. And regardless of what that does to her, I'm, I'm willing to take the risk, you know? Not to, not to be like, some of you may die, and I'm willing to take that risk. But some of them may die, and I'm willing to take that risk. <laughs> Or what is that? What is that line? You're like, many of you will die, but that is a risk I'm willing to take, or something like that. I think that's the actual line. No, I thought I could. I'm so stupid. I thought I could jump up. I've wasted so many, so many turns. I thought I could jump up. They've taken position. Not to make this weird, but like, not weird, but. I feel like we want to control the center of the map whenever possible. It's very chess-like, you know what I mean? Like, I need to have room for me to run away if needed. And I think controlling the center of the map is how to do that. I was trying to get the high ground and the center, but it just didn't, it, it clearly didn't work out because I can't, I can't leap those, those bounds. Unfortunately, he's going to run away, so if I want to steal more, I've got to run into them, which is pretty risky. That's actually, that is not without, you know... That is not without risk, so to speak. Um, let's actually move the proper way. I've got to believe this is probably the main pathway up. I, I'm probably not acrobatic enough to actually get a huge like leap into the air. Question is, what is my distance on my magics? If I can cure here... How about Kira? Is it the same? It is. Okay. That's fine. We can Kira. So, basically no harm, no foul. You have Grouse here. He's kind of chilling. He's, he's figuring out his life. I mean, so are we. So... Oh, he's got a range attack. I should have known. He, he's basically untouchable because we didn't uh, we didn't put our uh, archer in here. We should we probably should have, but we chose not to utilize an archer today. I'm gonna try to position differently here. Perfect. That feels pretty good. We have done nothing to them so far. We missed a steal and took a bunch of damage and got a treasure. We are, uh, I would argue, severely behind. And the one good thing is I can throw fire at their mage. Well, I have a very clear answer here on what's the right play. That's always nice. We counters? Man, me too. What's Katie gonna do? Or Kitty or whatever her name is. Oh, she's gonna focus. Okay. I respect it. Need to get Adele back in here and get the steals going. It is actually pretty important for us to get that rolling, I feel. Oh, that's a lot of damage. I don't think we have counter on him, do we? I think we had counter on uh, our last bonga uh, in Final Fantasy Tactics Advance, but not this one. Oh my goodness. He's getting, he's getting brutalized. He's cut off now. He can't leave. Rend power. This is... This is, a, this is an all-out assault. 
This is crazy. Yeah, David, stay back. You don't want any part of this. Can I get him? Sticky fingers. All right. Critical's good. Can cure up Adele, although it feels like our Bonga here needs the most help. Might have items like you that we can use, but I mean that is against the law, so that would put ourselves in a terrible spot if we try to use items. 44%. Probably because he's got set up a little bit differently. I mean, I'm still going to go for it. Oh man, the miss sucks. Dude, I just need Adele to have so much speed so she can keep on trying to steal. That's really what I think I need. Does he still have air render distance? Oh, he's dropping down. Oh no, we know who he's looking at. Know exactly who he's looking at. He could kill our thief. I mean, our our friend. I don't even know who he is. He's he's a thief. I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it. he's a thief. But he could kill him. That's not exactly preferred right now. This might seem silly, but I'm gonna I'm gonna actually go for the first aid and then go deeper. I mean, silly or like suicidal, but it, it's it's important. The re so here's the reason it's important. I should talk about that. I, I, I'm trying to steal from them. I Genuinely, that's the only reason. Because I'm actively not trying to kill my opponents. I'm trying to steal from them. And that takes time. And to get time, I need to use first aid. It feels kind of dumb. Ah, man, maybe I won't be able to. Maybe I have to accept that I can't steal loot and I need to kill them all. I don't know. That's such a hard thing to deal with. Because I, I really, really would like to be set up for... You know, for for some stealing. I don't know. It just it would be nice. Probably shouldn't go after the guy that has forty four percent, but he seemed to be the leader, so I feel like he might have something nice. You know what I mean? Like it's a lower percent for a better item, maybe. That's what I'm really thinking it could be. He's got to be going after the thief. Oh, he's not. Interesting. Going after our our mage. I mean, that's fair. I do feel like they're kind of outclassed here. Like, we just have so much better, uh, like, numbers. Or our stats are just significantly better. 44%. Got him. Yeah, we got, we got some wood. That's so exciting. What a time to be alive. I will need to move forward a little bit. I'm not I'm not trying to abandon my, my buddy here. I'm just trying to refocus. I've got two different groups now, so let's see if we can provide some damage. He hits decently. But I also hit pretty decent. Feel like this dude might be in trouble at 5 HP. Just maybe. If we, oh, if we can get the first kill too, oh, that'd be insane. That is also really nice. I mean, the negative is I haven't stolen from this dude yet, but you know, he's he's just gonna die. We need to accept that we can't steal from everyone. Some of them are just gonna have to be killed. Blind, that's annoying. I don't have a Suna either. I have eye drops, but you know, the law is the law. Thunder, okay. Oh, the miss. It truly does suck to suck. Let's 
60 damage seems like a lot. Not gonna lie, don't love it. Although it hurts him too, so I guess that's somewhat comforting. I mean, Finn here, he's gotta heal his buddy. There's no way. Is he still not gonna heal or something? Like, what's his plan? There it is. He's gonna heal, that's good, that's a good guy. The negative here though is I get a turn again. And now I can burst them both down, I believe. I think, I think the elevation works for this. Yep. This kill, this hurts them a lot. KO, the heal meant nothing. We get first kill. And we wait, because we don't need to move, we just need to kill. I don't mind uh, targeting the, the mage next. I think that's a fair, it's a fair target. 50%, let's go. Two for four, that's not bad. Cotton flu. Um, what's his? We might be able to do something fancy here. Oh, not at all. Uh, never mind. Fancy has been canceled. I was hoping to heal uh, our Bonga, but I'll heal Luso. That's fine. If this misses, oh, thank everything. I was really concerned it would miss because <laughs> she definitely needs heals. Like she's in so much trouble right now. Counter if I just rend his power. Oh, I can't even do that. I could body slam though. Nah. That doesn't make sense to me. What's Davis gonna do? He really is just chilling. He truly does nothing. To be honest, like I, I love that though. I really do. Like, he's just not doing much, he's just chilling. I played so many games where your like escort person would throw themselves at the enemy's like forces, and I'm just like, bro, this is not like please don't, and then they would just die. You know what I mean? Like they would just do that, die, and then it'd be like, I wonder what happened. Like it's it's refreshing to have an escort mission where the character does not throw themselves to towards certain death. It is uh, it is wonderful. What are you gonna do, Naveen? Taking all the damage. And you can't get to my mage anymore. That was the whole point of putting her down there. He's gotta go through Luso and our mage. So it feels it feels pretty good, actually. He's gonna heal himself, I mean that's fine, I guess. It's cute. Um, this is okay, I guess. Not a huge fan of it. I think Adele could definitely die. But she can also loot the, uh, the archer. Got there. Soul Cephal, love it. Again, I truly do see value in this. Uh, there's no possible way this works, by the way. Yeah, no way. I was trying to figure out if I could somehow heal uh, Adele without healing everyone else, but there's just no way. Make sure. Okay, this is our bonga. It's Garrett. Cool. I was like, he's the blue one, right? Blue versus red. Red versus blue. All that stuff. I guess I could just position to the side. I think that'll do a little bit more damage, right? Yeah. About 50% more. It's not bad. Oh, 
Okay, so we're definitely at the point now where like Girl's got a hundred HP. Wait, do we start do we start helping her out <laughs> at all? Does she need assistance? Uh potentially. Let's actually position in a manner to maybe help her. We basically if we free up our mage, then maybe we can do something here. I wanna at least hit their banga down, just on the off chance that uh their mage tries to heal him. Oh, they're freeing, uh, they're freeing Adele. That's very nice of them. That's very kind. Okay, that's the right one. That's the right square that doesn't kill us. Love it. So we got three steals, and everyone around it thou has been stolen from. So that feels pretty good. Again, we don't have to like steal infinitely over and over and over. What I'm really looking forward to, and, and I've talked about this before, is I want a slow advantage from stealing loot. I want to get like three or four extra loot from a fight, and then through that, eventually hit the point where everyone's like, oh, like wow, we can make more and more weapons. Like it's actually kind of nice, you know. Um, there's probably like a more efficient way to do it, but I just have never played this game before. And I, because of the way the equipment works in this game, I really think that makes sense. Like, I think, it, I believe that's an intelligent way to play. I don't know, I can't really think of any game, to be honest, where like, any Final Fantasy game where like stealing items from an enemy like gradually is a bad idea. Like it always feels like a great idea. Wrong bonga. <laughs> I don't know why I keep on thinking I'm the red one. Oh, no no chance. Alright, well we gotta go for the uh, the silly the silly steal then, if that's gonna be the case. We got I think we gotta go for the uh, I sure hope I can steal with like 20x percent or whatever. 25, let's go. Ah, I mean it's what you get, it's what you expect. <laughs> that's not a uh, that's not a shocker. Well, let's heal her because she's taking quite a bit of damage. I mean, I know we literally have Garrett here on his knees, but uh, he'll be fine. He'll be okay. Maybe. <laughs> no way. Okay, I guess I gotta move. First time I've had to move in a while, right? I think I'll have to move. Or is this... This probably hits Garrett no matter what, actually. Hmm. I have positioned myself in a pickle. Um, I guess this is fine, actually. Because what I'll do is I'll move... I'll just throw like a fire at this dude or something. It's fine. And then Garrett will get a turn and be able to be able to free himself. In theory. Because what he can do is he can just strike him now. Like 36 damage. That this will kill the enemy. And now the mission is Garrett, run, run, run away. Please. I don't think Caleb can get that distance, can he? No, he keeps only attacking. Perfect. I was trying to position in a way that made sense. Again, I wanted to top up Adele, but there's definitely an argument that that was a bad heal because Garrett was so low. Um, and to be 100% honest, I didn't plan out that sequence there, although it worked out really well. Um, and I and I could have and I should have. I, I just didn't. But now, now, we can actually heal our, our buddy here. Unfortunately, we can't heal both of our friends. We've got this weird, like, their mage looks like he's on our side because he's so close to everyone. Like, he's just, he looks like one of our mages at this point. Should just recruit him. Like, I know we're defending the thief, but also, like, you know, a dollar's a dollar.
Yeah, he's going back to his side. Smart. Smart play. Yeah, we really do these, like, fights with one less person in a manner. Because we do exclusively lock Adele to stealing loot. She does counter, though. And, and she is a person on the team, but... She is not... She is not combat-focused in the slightest. She is very much like, I sure hope she can steal some items. Like, that is her entire life. I think it works out well, though. I enjoy it. Selfishly speaking. Got sticky fingers. All right then. Oh, the miss, the the swing and a miss. That hurts. Katie, she's been really chilling. I don't think she's taken any damage yet. She's gonna try to blind. Oh no, that's gonna do a number on our uh, stealing. I think. Oh, it misses. That's good. That's reassuring. The good thing, I guess, is we're at the point where the mage is just, like, whacking us. And if you've got a black mage that's, like, just hitting you with the rod, that's just such a... You know things have not gone correct. Like, they've not gone well. You know things are, uh, you know, hidden, hidden in a bad spot. Again. We continue the loot level one steal. Constantly. If I get loot level two, everyone better watch out. That'll come one day. Rend magic. Okay. Ooh, they're kind of they're kind of healing up. I should probably hurt them for that. It probably makes sense to actually kill someone here. Probably the mage. He went HP critical. He keeps on helping. No one likes that. Yeah, we didn't steal nearly as much in Final Fantasy Tactics Advance. But I feel like we could just steal weapons and stuff. So, it was very clearly not worth it because we couldn't do anything with those weapons. They were almost always worse than ours. There were a few, like, really good ones. Really, really good ones we missed. I think it was, like, Ritz we, we fought and we, we just did not steal the weapon we could have, like, it was like an insane bow, I think it was. And we just completely missed the opportunity. Going for the swing. This is still really good position for us to just cast fire again. Just do that thing, but like again. Miss again. Is he like fireproof or something? I don't know, it's weird. I feel like if I were him, I would have uh, cured and then gone one step back so they weren't next to each other. That's kind of a weird idea to get closer to the person as we're actively trying to hit both of them with spells. Don't love the strategy, but like, more power to them. We're also at the point where we can just ignore any sort of danger towards our white mage. Like, if Grouse here tries to go for it, there, there's no reason. Like, they, they just will not win.
Garrett taking so much damage. You gotta always heal him up, man. Always. Without fail. She has counter. I don't know if I'd do that. You do 16. She does, uh, what is it? 26. That is a math problem that is very easy for them to solve. They should recognize how much damage they're really gonna take there. Is he really just immune to fire? I don't know. I'm gonna I'm gonna target the uh, archer though, because they're in a position where um, I don't want to hit Luso. Like that just seems dumb. Actually, you know what? Let's not even move. Let's like steal and wait. I think that'll give us our turn faster. Well, actually. That's sick. Got there. Got exactly what we wanted. I didn't I didn't even know if we'd steal again because it was a 25% chance, but I'm happy that it worked out. Honestly, let's just Oh, this will heal him, won't it? I think it will. Doesn't this heal? <laughs> That's so funny. I don't know why it's, it kills me. It's, it's kind of funny. Okay. Let's position up here a little bit. And he's in closed. No moving. He's done. Grouse is done. We're going to focus on the archer now for stealing loot, if we can. Ooh. It's not great. It's crazy how long some of these fights are. Gonna rend power on my uh, white mage. That's sick plays, bro. Sick plays. Love it. Unfortunately, I have to move at least one square before I can again resume my thievery. Twenty-three percent, not good. Ah, oh, just can't do it. Again, I'm not frustrated really at this point because we've hit the like every every future like thief thievery like. Action is a blessing when it works. It really is. Because of the fact of, like, that we just don't... We've stolen so much already, you know? We've hit the it's really hard to steal for phase of this. You know? I just got the funny number. Funny number HP. Alright, cool. I'm not even worried about healing. I think we're good. He kind of flip-flopped those. He should have rendered Garrett's power and then rendered our White Mage's magic. Those, those last two turns were uh, a little bit odd. A little bit odd, a little bit weird. This could hurt. But I'm still gonna go for it. Oh, we're gonna kill. Oh, we're gonna kill Adele if we do that, though. I can't. Oh, I can't justify it. I can't justify killing Adele. I feel bad, but I can't. And I don't want to kill the archer because I can steal from him. Oh no. Oh nuts. Truly lost in the sauce. I'm surprised Davis doesn't just leave. If he's a thief, he doesn't want to be here once we succeed. He probably doesn't want to pay us either.
Oh, we're so close. One HP off. Can't run away from me, buddy. Cannot run away from me. Almost there. We got a bombshell. Very exciting. Grass got one HP in a dream. Twenty-three percent. Let's go. No way. It worked. We got a soul sample. Dude, good for us. That's that is fantastic. That is fan freaking tastic. A very, I would say this is an extremely successful mission for for thieving. I mean, the reason we wanted two was because we thought we'd get more items, and we probably would have. But I don't know if we could have won this with three, like with three active members. Because we would have had, you know, our, our Moogle buddy and everything. Like, it would have been a lot of, like, walking around and trying to steal and then hoping that the other three, three people don't die. And I don't know if we could have done that. Because, what, we cut we cut Garrett out at that point? That seems risky. I was hoping Garrett could get to the archer. Unfortunately, that is not the case right now. Garrett cannot do it. I see. Nor can Luso. It's unfortunate. What's Katie gonna do? He's gonna go forward a little bit. Oh, we just one away. Unlucky. It's all good. We're not gonna. We're not gonna just chill. Like we're not gonna wait around and see. Uh, we know we can't steal from the archer. Really, it's like 13% chance. It's not gonna be good. So we might as well just end it. Got there. Cactus fruit. Ooh, that's them driven off. What got into them? Calling us thieves. By the way, I see you're carrying quite a weapon there. Why didn't you use it? Oh, it's far too heavy for someone of my frail constitution to wield, I'm afraid. And it's quite valuable, too. I couldn't bear to see it sullied with horrible blood. Huh, I see. I guess. I was just thinking the fight would have been a whole lot easier with it. I can see why you'd want to keep it in good condition, though. Wasn't easy getting my hands on this one, let me tell ya. And the adamantite inlay is quite breathtaking. In any case, many thanks for a job well done. Well, I've pressing business in the Galeria Deep, so I'll be off now. <laughs> this should be a mission failed. <laughs> we help the thief get away with thievery, that feels bad. The way of the meek. I don't know where the other mission is. Is it all down a range? Oh, it's Leslie Ford's cottage. Just what are the judges? There are a few who can answer the question. Hey, let's go. I'm curious. A simple question. Ah, welcome, welcome, Luso. How may I aid you? A client wanted to know about the judges, what they are specifically. I thought you'd be the person to ask, Leslie Ford. What are the judges? A fascinating question to be sure. All right, I'll try to explain this as simply as possible. The judges are less individuals and more a great magic. A magic cast upon all Jyland. I will write more for you and you can show it to your client. 
concerning judges received. Clan notes updated. In fact, you may show it to whom, who, whomsoever you please. Only, do not tell anyone that it was I who gave it to you. Okay. Don't tell anyone he gave it to us. Uh, concerning judges. Perfect. The history of judges and the law began several hundred years ago here in Jiland. There is a place in Jiland called the Wellspring of Magic, and it is this source of power that feeds the near immortal magical constructs we call judges. Will the judges and their laws hold sway over all Jiland? It is the way of this magic that, for one to benefit from its effects, one must swear an oath to the judges to uphold their laws. It is thought this is intended to prevent misuse of the judges and is at all times an entirely voluntary oath. Only those who desire its benefits need swear. As we can see, there is nothing in the structure of laws that cannot be explained by our modern theory of magic. Interesting. I don't I know I don't have to go to go to this area but I like to go here Fay mischief fairies that live deep in the woods they delight in causing mischief what is he a Keegan um I don't really care for Keegan. Ah, we're under attack. So this is like probably a random encounter then. Interesting. Or maybe a mission, I don't know. <sighs> Defeat all foes. Targeting the user are forbidden. Huh? So you can't heal yourself, essentially. Only others can heal you. I think this is fine. Uh, let's do power. We're, if this is a random counter, we're just gonna, we're just gonna roll them. We're just gonna roll them with, with sheer force of will. Want to focus on the treasure first. <gasps> There's a chocobo. Is it my friend? I'd love if it was. Huge fan of that idea. Actually, you know what? Now I mention I'm going for this. Why would I not have my mage go for the treasure? Make sure we got everyone grouped up properly. That's not great. That is a lot of damage. Oh, I forgot. We made him a thief, didn't we? We changed him up. Perfect. If we can get them all grouped up when we cast magics, oh, it's going to be insane. I still don't know if the chocobos are enemies, so I don't want to hurt him. Meteorite? Oh, let's just kill Garrett. 
If Garrett dies, that could be GG. Let's go in. Looks like the magic points took a bit of that. Five damage? Oh, that's so bad. That is very sad. Much sad, not very good. Archer's Bane, that's an interesting ability. Probably blocks arrows or something. They got unique names for it and everything. Okay, so the Chocobo looks like the hardest thing to fight. And it is certainly against me. Okay, I see. It's certainly against me. Bro, I will literally just counter. Yeah, I don't love how I position. I could have positioned a lot better. It's all good though. I feel bad about this, but the Chocobo has got to go. We got to hurt him. MP Shield's cute though. It's a cool little ability. Petrifying Rattle? This could be crazy. If this petrifies. <gasps> Double miss. Critical failure. Critical failure is insane. And they pull back. I actually like that. Going the White Wind. I respect it. Makes sense. They took a bit of damage there. It only heals the Goblin. I feel like White Wind's a really bad ability then. I feel like you need to heal everyone to really make it worthwhile. Magic Hammer. Oh, this confuses, doesn't it? Uh, maybe not. We don't seem confused. We seem very clear on our mission and our goal. Um... I think I need to... The problem is that the Trotobo has so much HP, but it has like, I feel like it takes a bunch of damage. I don't know, maybe that's just because of how I attacked it. I kind of want to, I kind of feel like I should try to steal loot from the Chocobo, but like I said, I'm really not focused on that. Like I'm just focused on like killing everything. Whether or not that's good or bad. Dude, they're, they're having such a bad time. Like with their attempts and everything, I, I almost feel bad. Uh, Furthest doesn't need to heal that much. I think Garrett needs it, though. Ooh, this is not a fight they want to take. I'm pretty sure we just win this. Because they hit us, we hit back, and then we get a turn and hit them again. Like, it's just over and over and over. That's all it is. I can't get to the Chocobo to hurt him, unfortunately. But I can maybe take out their uh, their heals. Well, maybe not take him out. But I can do I can do a bit of damage. Drop him to HP critical and everything. <gasps> They're positioned perfectly for a uh, for a fire here. Oh, they they really they really put themselves in a in a in an area of the map. I mean, it's gonna it's gonna hurt my. Uh, don't get me wrong; it's, it is going to hurt my thief, but I think it's worth it. I think it's worth it. Ko, 
Yep, there it is. Got there. Love it, dude. Love it. That's so sick. Actually, you know what? What am I doing? Why would I not just target the Chocobo? It's at 5, H 5 HP and it's over. I can't kill the fairy. Auraman Wing. Love it. This is so good. Meteorite. I mean, Meteorite's a scary ability, but when they've lost so many people, I really don't care. Like, I really don't think it's a big deal. We're just gonna heal our buddy here. I mean, I know I missed Luso and that, that was a stupid idea, but it's fine. One thing I'm, I haven't done is I haven't targeted myself yet, which is actually good because I forgot about that rule. Um, <laughs> Alright, well, if they're going to reflex on me, I'm just going to steal loot. I'm going to try. I certainly will try. Goblin attack. I think we should go attack the other fairy. Bring him down to like 3 HP. Or, you know, completely miss. That's also a reasonable thing we can do. Yeah, miss reflex needs to, needs to take some magic damage, though. Because I don't know how we're going to physically hurt her. I was hoping the other fairy would be hit so, be, so they would be critical so I could like finish him off with Garrett here, but maybe we can do just a little bit of damage. And maybe our thief can get there. Oh no, maybe we'll just kill him. That was a good hit. That was a very good hit. Walk him off there. Good heal here. I mean, our power two is really putting in work, I think. I know I can't hit him. I don't think I can, at least. Yeah. But I can try to steal loot. I didn't really want to focus on this at all, but if it's a 0% or 45, I've got to clearly go for the 45. Like, that is obviously the answer. Oh, casting holy on themselves? That's cute. Hurt their own ally, dude. They hurt their own ally for that. That was not worth it. They hurt their own ally, healed themselves, and then hurt us. I mean, I guess ultimately they kind of came out ahead, but they just don't have the resources right now to be doing damage to their own party. Like, I'll do that, like, on the off chance. I'm like, oh, I'm in a really good spot, sure. But, like, to just do it thinking that it's, oh, that is poor play. Poor play. I mean, it's good for us, I guess, but uh, I feel bad for their their ally. Their whole, their whole chances of winning this. And I could just cut them off here. I guess they kind of already are because of our, our black mage. Gonna cast holy again. Perfect. I'm so tempted to go for the loot, but like we we got a person we can hit, and we need to we need to follow up with that. Even if they counter. Perfect. This should kill him? Oh, HP critical. Boo. 
Honestly, I actually don't really care about blocking them off, so if it's between that and killing someone, I'll just kill them. And I think I might be able to still, like, move maneuver here. Oh, I can. Perfect. Look at that. I don't. Th I think reflex is gonna be a thing. Yeah, it is. What thievery do I have? Steal gill? Sure. How much money can I steal? Ah, eighty. That's kind of cool. That's neat. We're just having a grand old time stealing money. Lapa is gonna pull back here. Level holy again, sure. Sure, sure, sure. I don't know how much HP Adele has. She's not critical, but I wonder if Holy could potentially kill her. I don't know, actually. Oh, it, it will actually miss entirely. I was hoping to go for another loot steal, but might not have that luxury. Especially if we can just get over here and... Actually, what can we really do here? I guess we can rend magic. Because we can't really physically hit her. Red magic would be ideal just because we'd be able to reduce the amount of holy that heals her. But at the end of the day, I'm pretty sure. First off, let me position correctly. I'm pretty sure we just we just win here. Eventually. One day. Such a time sink. Gonna holy again? I don't know if they have the HP or MP for it. So far, no. I guess we do get our uh, our final loot chance. It's crazy, 45% we still haven't hit it. And we never will. With that, that's our final chance, I believe. We're just getting our Black Mage a turn. That's all that matters. Oh wait, we get another turn? Well, that's exciting. Hey, we will hit it. We got a tiger hide. That's so sick and also kind of sad. Love it. I don't know if they're endangered in Ivalis. Bro, no world. No chance. I think this is going to give them the holy again. This kills me, man. Yeah, yeah, there it is. Oh man. I don't mind like losing battles and like going through all that, but like one of the things that does annoy me is like when I have a very clear win and I just can't do it, you know what I mean? Like when we're just like chilling forever trying to get this one win, it's like, oh my gosh. Because it feels like I'm spending time when I know the result. I mean we do get we do get the chance for more loot, which is kinda nice. But I'd much rather prefer the kill. To be a hundred percent. Imagine I'm talking like this and we somehow lose this. <laughs> That'd be crazy. We lose this fight. Just this you know, just out of the blue. I'm gonna run magic. It's ninety percent to hit. It's pretty decent. I feel like I should just do it because it's annoying. I mean they should be dead here. They should be dead here for sure. But like, I don't know, man. I don't got the answers. No way! That's impossible. 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 Dude, absolutely impossible. Gonna have to go Hypello here. I don't understand it. 22% maybe? No shot, dude. Magic down. Like, what can they... The re reflex is OP against our build. Because we just don't, like... We're just not equipped to do anything that cool. <laughs> uh, we don't need to... Even if we get the MP, we probably don't even need to, like, fire. Uh. We just need to fire. Oh my gosh, dude, we did it. That took forever. That was crazy. Green liquid. I hope it was worth it. 
Hector is the MVP. What a champion. It, just, just an insane attempt there. I think that was a random encounter, but it had a name, so I don't know. It's really curious. Alright, well, let's take a look at our units. I know we're, can, we're around a little bit late, but... I've mastered new abilities. Just don't want to forget this. But have you mastered new abilities? Is it the chainmail that you mastered? It is the chainmail you've mastered. Cool. In that case, I don't care about you. What about you? That is the safeguard you've mastered. Okay. So no one's mastered new abilities that matters. I mean, I've mastered red magic, but that doesn't do much for me. Pyra, Cura, Body Slam. Dang. It's all good. Alright, well that is actually going to wrap us up for today. Thank you all so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed it. And when you come back, I'm going to be playing more Final Fantasy Tactics Advance 2 Grimoire of the Rift. Ah, what a title. <laughs>